Another resource that we have in Clever is called Twisted Wave. And what Twisted Wave does, it allows us to record our voice and it will save it up to our Google Drive. As a teacher, I can create a recording, I can read a small passage, and then allow my students to read, to listen to what I've just read. So if I click on how to use Twisted Wave, I'm going to click on the link, and it's going to open it up, and it automatically logged me in. For, real quick, I'm going to log out. That way you can see what it looks like. So I'm going to sign in, and notice I'm going to sign in with Google. Going back to, I'm going to use my district Google account. So I click on William Snyder, wsnyder at yc.net, and this will log me as me. Now, notice I have a recording already that's here. So let's say I want to go ahead and create a new recording. I would click on New, and I'm going to create an empty file. I can upload a file if I want. If I want to import a file, I can. But I'm going to do an actual recording. So I'm going to do a new file. And notice the tools for recording will come up. Now here I have my recording. So if I click on this button, it's going to start recording my voice. Now notice it's the it's recording as I go. Here's the seconds that I have. And it's actually recording my voice. So if I go ahead and I hit Stop, there's my recording. If I want to listen to it, I can click on back. You see how it works? Very, very easy. It's kind of like those old school tape recorders, but digital way. So if I click go back, and if I want to go ahead and save it, so I click on file, notice I can send it to Google Drive. So once I put it into Google Drive, it puts it into my Google Drive, and then I can share it back with my students or I can go ahead and turn in an audio to my teacher. So I click on send to Google Drive. Here I have the title and remember I asked you to do an assignment. This is where you're going to do it. I want you to do a recording and so I'm going to go ahead and call this New ZLA. So I want you to call it New ZLA and then you can go ahead and record and send it to Google Drive. So when you found that article that you were going to use in the classroom, I want you to record a minute, two minutes audio on how you would use that article in the classroom. So like, for example, that when I picked about genetics, I would tie that in with my PPAT lesson and why. So if I click on send to Google Drive, here it goes. And it's going to ask me which account do I want to upload it to. I'm going to upload it to my W. Snyder. So it sends it to my Google Drive. And there it is. To grab that, I'm going to go ahead and close it out. I'm going to go back into my internal portal. I'm going to click on Google. I'm going to make sure it logged me into my district account. So if I click on it, yep, it's my district account. I'm going to go to the Apps Launcher here. I'm going to hit Drive. There it is. And a lot of times when you create something to Google, it's going to show you in quick access. But if I want to do a search, I can just do a search. And I'm going to call it news e l a click on it and do a search there it comes give it a moment come on google you can do this there is that one that i did news e l a so i can click on it give it a moment and then now i can play and listen to it but then there it goes now, this is what you're going to do. Don't forget, that New ZLA article that you found, I want you to go ahead, create a Twisted Wave audio recording, and I want you to upload it to our Google Classroom to show that you have can use Twisted Wave. Thank you so much. Have a great day.